All righty. <clears throat> Hello, Butter My Pickle. Welcome to the stream. Happy to have you. Welcome, welcome. Let's see. Where are we at? Well, that's not necessarily good if the screen just went black. Let me go see. I went to the wrong one. Haha. <laughs> I went to uh, E4 instead of Victoria 3. <laughs> I'm a professional, I promise. <laughs> uh, if it went black, my apologies. There it goes. There's Victoria 3. Perfect. <laughs> Alrighty, where are we at right now? Uh, looks like we haven't conquered any land as Brazil. We are the 11th wor ranking world power. We're improving some relations. We're building up steel mills. I think today we're going to want to go and work on our economy a little bit more. How is our economy? Uh, we're built taxes. Uh, I would eventually like to repeal these just so I don't want to do any consumption taxes. It actually hurts our people. Uh, since I've learned a little bit since the last time we played, we're not paying for any of this. We're going to upgrade our military as much as possible here. We actually need a lot more paper mills looking at that. Uh, that would probably be something we'll focus on as well. Um, buildings, we're on the medium construction or tier two. I don't want to pay for that. Iron is expensive. Maybe we just stick down one, save us about 10 grand, make sure we have positive income. <clears throat> I hope all of the Americans got out and voted today as well. I know I did. It was actually a pretty quick time and we just dropped a rank that's unfortunate uh let's see unpredictive trade routes let's go ahead and cancel all those save us the bureaucrats because we need those uh and they're in no short supply actually they are in a short supply let's be realistic um we have people in our trade uh custom region which is fine i don't see any issues with that balance wood is expensive clothes is expensive all that's fine i don't see any major issues i understand we have a shortfall we'll make do with that later Let's see. Buildings, buildings, buildings. Where are we at? Uh, let's just go straight here. This is so much better. We have population. Do we have... We do not have infrastructure. We do not have railways yet. Okay. Just need to see where we're at. It's been a little while since we played. It's only been a week. Waiting for the governor race and category results. I am completely there. Just... I live in Michigan, so it's uh, swing state. So I have no idea where that's going. <laughs> Whether you're on one side or the other, it could go either way. So... Although it doesn't really, it depends on which part of the the state you're in, uh, that it makes it very different. Uh, I didn't think Connecticut was that uh that up for grabs. I'm pretty sure it's just a democratic state for the most part. Uh, it's interesting. I'm not gonna necessarily say you know political beholdings one way or another. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, it just pretty much just goes to a Democrat and that's it. Um, not that I do want this to be about politics, but politics is what's going on in life right now. So. <laughs> <laughs> if you will we're gonna go and upgrade this plus one and we'll just kind of let time go on we got a building actually i think we're doing two steel mills right now unless we have it back there uh but that is the hot topic for today probably so yeah because poll the first batch of polls just closed three minutes ago at the start of stream so those are going to be uh coming in today um so yeah Buildings are going fine. Uh, I don't actually think this is an issue. We're having ooh opposition interest groups approval. That hurts you guys, actually. I do actually care about that because we have a stupid amount of radicals, and I, I'm still figuring out how to deal with the radicals in this game. I'm not sure. I they pop up very early and don't necessarily go away very quickly, uh, which is a thing. I'm not gonna say it's good or bad. Uh, okay, so we need our own arms industry. Uh, that definitely makes sense in our... That we need our... Oh, we already have an arms industry. It makes quite a bit of money. Hey, Grape2, welcome, welcome. Yeah, being ahead in 13 points in any race, uh, it's not really contested unless you really have done something poor. Uh, we need more paper mills as well. Uh, paper is something we need. I would prefer just to get... I'll eat the extra expense, I don't care. I would prefer to get that passed. Ironclad ships. Nah, we're not doing any of those. We don't worry about that. All right. What do you got for infrastructure? How are we doing? Uh, you have plenty. Uh, wood is something we need. I'm going to go ahead and take that up plus three. Uh, which, to that regard, uh, this go to the bottom. And I do want to go. I'll spend the money to go ahead and go tier two. Uh, it's going to cost us some, a little bit, but that's okay. In, in the long run, it's going to make goods cheaper. And 12k is not a huge deficit for us, ironically. Um, I would like some more paper mills. Where we got for paper mills? Can you guys upgrade? Oh yeah, we can go for like sulfur processing, which we don't have any sulfur inside any of our provinces. Uh, does anyone want to do sulfur trading with us? 
food iron we can pass out fabric i don't think that's necessarily that great there isn't a huge amount of demand for that how about sulfur though that i could get behind anything for sulfur no not in abundance like i would want i uh, don't care about that your shortfall yeah yeah we'll deal with that later i'm not too concerned it is hurting our taxes a little bit but meh we're already working on one. We got one of our steel mills up. Let's see. Really? All right, so like everything is just what we need. <laughs> Beautiful. It's going to cost a little bit. Not too big of a difference there. Um, what do we got tech-wise? Uh, it's just for processing the paper. I'm assuming it's when you're going to do the pulp processing, it breaks down the... Uh, the carbon chains uh, into a more refined pulp that's easier to press. That's what I'm guessing for the chemical compound uh, reduction. Um, and you may be able to uh, use some uh, crappier versions of wood instead of having the nice heartwood. Of course, that's my guess. I'm not a uh, material science for paper by any means. I just understand that it's 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 paper. You know, <laughs> that is what it is. <laughs> uh, so. I'm just taking an educated guess on that from my day-to-day -day life. Plastics and injection molding. But I digress. Alright, so what do you need for your... What are we missing? Shortage of steel. Excuse me. We just built... Oh, we're in the process of building our steel mills, I see. Where's this one going at? Here? Why are there no... Hold up. Why are there no employees here? Are we out of people? Is there is there no one to work? No, there's 18,000 people that can work. Why are there no workers? I understand why we have a steel shortage. No one's working in the steel mill. I would rather... I'm going to turn this off. Here, go work in the steel mill. That's where you need to go. Uh, coffee plantation? That's probably going to get turned off too. Uh, just to get people in there. Lead mines are fine. Logging camps are good. Uh, the... The fish wharfs? I don't care about those. Get rid of those. I need those people to go to the steel mills. That's like, you don't get an option there. Yep, too many buildings. There you go. You're unemployed? Go to the steel mill. That's what you have to do. It's, you work at the steel mill or you don't work. That's, that. those are your options. Um, yeah. Because I'm assuming you just, is it special employment? No, we're, we're missing laborers. Yeah, we got plenty of laborers here. I want both of those though. Ah, uh, coffee plantation, right? 13,000 laborers. Okay, well you get more employed. No, go work in the steel mill. Go. <laughs> yeah, it's also way too much infrastructure. Hello, steel is expensive. Go work there. Seriously, zero laborers? We have three people employed? I have issues with that. Leave the coffee. No coffee for us. Yep, you're employed. Go to the steel mill. This, this is just how this works. Are you going to this urban center instead? No, no. Don't go to the urban center. Go to the steel mill. <laughs> the steel mill is where you are needed. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to get rid of this just because it's going to raise the overall unrest. Do we get rid of the lead mines? I'm almost... Like, we have enough peasants. Uh, just qualifications is taking forever. I want a university here, I think. Uh, just to upgrade the, uh, the rate of people converting over their roles. Yes, pops are indeed dumb. Hey, we we need uh we need steel in the economy, and we're not gonna do anything about it. So yes. Oh look, we don't need steel anymore. Awesome. That's an active. Uh, can we get tools? I can get a whole bunch of stools from there. Stools? No, I want tools from America. There you go. Go ahead and import those. Uh, that that should help everyone. Every part of the uh, economy is gonna get helped out with that. Um, and then I want to go ahead and build a bunch of barracks. We're gonna start going to war for uh. Or uh, South America. We're going to take it all for ourselves. I will take the plus 20% for he public health health insurance. That's something we need. Reduce that mortality so uh, we'll be in a happier state. Lumber camps are going to be good. It looks like you guys just need to be built up. You can have iron mines. I don't think iron is a big deal. Oh, iron is a must. Here, you get some iron mines. Where's that? Here. Nope, that's a rubber plantation. I'm not interested in that. Uh, so five. 
Five should be plenty, and the rest goes to logs. Uh, that should be good. This is just going to get built up super fast. No one's going to know it's going to hit them. You can go, oh, we look, we're subsistent farmers. No, you go, you go to the lumber mine, you go to the iron mine, and that's about it. We have our additional bureaucrats, fantastic. Uh, we need more paper, though. That's kind of whatever one of our big expenses. Construction goods aren't helping either. What do we need here? Um, construction cost, wood, iron, tools. I mean, it's just iron right now, so actually, wood isn't that bad. Buildings, construction. Um, you tick down. I want the university, and then after that, we'll be fine. You guys go after the arms industry, though. You and you. I want the arms industry first. There we go. Only a 6k deficit. That's not too bad. I won't complain about that. Unproductive trade routes. No more meat. Okay. Fertilizer. Anyone want that? Uh, Yeah, Russia wants that. Sure, take it. Uh, Colombia can also have it. Although it does cost me bureaucrats, unfortunately. Alrighty. So you guys never joined our trade league. Right? Or our... Our customs union. I wish it was a trade league instead. Oh no, you're actually already in. You're in. Go here. Paraguay is not in at all. Hey Brad, how's it going? Is it possible that Paraguay and Uruguay is puppets for nice borders? Uh, I'm thinking I'm just going to eat them for nice borders. <laughs> I feel like that's a little bit more advantageous. Uh, Just... Oh, it's too high. I just need to go ahead and reduce opinion. That's fine. We can do that. Your way. Uh, we're going to damage our relations and stop improving, and we're going to damage those. Uh, we'll be, go ahead and become antagonistic there. Be happy. Disappearing interest, I'm sure. I'm not really doing anything with the Caribbean or Mexico, so I'm good with that. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, hmm... We can lose the approval. Man, I, I hate that scream of, of it during uh, that event. Any event someone gets, like, hurt, it makes me want to cringe. <laughs> that one got inactive. That's fine. Uh, food? Do you need anyone? Not really. 30 is not going to make a dent. That's not going to make a dent. It's not even worth my bureaucrats. Uh, I need, like, trade deals of over 300 at this point. Large trade deals. Um, cause we'll end up, or, or, my goal here is just kind of eat all of this and maybe go to Central America, but I also don't like the fact that you can't declare multiple wars since you can already have multiple fronts, uh, with multiple armies. So it's a little inconsistency there. Uh, you can have one more, uh, logging camp. Uh, no, I'll reserve it for the rubber plantation. Eventually we'll have, uh, railways. Trade center here. I mean, we make a ton in trade, apparently. You have no urban centers. Okay. Iron mines are being built along with university. I'm good with that. Because uh, we need that for our steel mill. Who is still lacking people. It has 2,000 laborers. It is making a profit. Uh, not that much, though. Like, I wish I could say, work here first, and then go to all these other jobs. Yes. I mean, didn't Brazil... I mean, if you look at the... You can kind of defer that from Brazil. It's tech... Oh, no. Trade. Nope. There was a... Where's the declared interest buttons? Diplomacy. Their interest. Right? All of that is technically in Brazil. Uruguay is and Paraguay isn't. Interesting. But wasn't there also a war in Paraguay where like 50% of all the males died? And so their population basically had a big reset? If that was his thing. Central America is the only declared interest right now. Why? I That was... Eh, that's fine. Everything else is fine. Okay, deficit became 7k. Only because of construction? There are mods for events sort of stuff. Perfect. I would love to change that. Because that, that's something they should have implemented day one of the game. That That is a, a thing. Like, I don't care what the standard productivity is, because, like, for my my steel mills, we need way more steel. Actually, hold up. Are we, uh, how are we building our tools? We're using the steel. Yeah, our market. What is our, do we have a surplus of this thing? Is that what's doing it? Trade, coffee, don't care about those. No, we have a deficit of steel. Why are we not doing steel? I understand we have a deficit of iron as well, but we're working on that. That shouldn't have that big of an impact on the steel mill. Right? It's not missing people or resources. It, it's good to go. Although, you know, 
Iron's expensive, so I understand. <laughs> right? But we're missing steel, like, down the production line. I would eat the bullet on the steel to make sure we have enough tools so we can do everything else. Right? It all funnels into itself. Um, let's see. No, I don't want to reduce. I will lose the legitimacy. I want this pass. Why are you guys not passing this? It's public health insurance. Like, allow our people to have health insurance. It's okay. Need lots of convoys. I'm going to ignore that because uh, convoys are broken and they don't function properly, uh, which is kind of annoying. All right, we have 1,400 convoys. We only need 1,000. It's telling me I don't have enough convoys. Yeah. Fix your game, math. Uh, why do you need coal and iron to make steel? So, steel is an interesting item because what you need from the coal, A, you need to use it to heat it up in the furnace, and then you can also use the carbon inside the coal to infuse it with the iron to go ahead and make your high carbon steels. And so steel is actually a product of carbon and steel itself, where you can get from coal itself. Um, and then obviously you can add additional elements to it, depending on what you're trying to do. Um, yeah, I don't know if you necessarily care about the, the science behind steel, but there's a little tidbit. <laughs> More than what you probably care about. So, wow, everyone is upset. Uh, let's see. I need to make you guys happier, so that way uh, you a lot less uh, of these people. Radicals, because every one of you guys being upset gives us additional radicals. Um, I can pay you to be happier. Uh, Industrialist, why are you so unhappy? Because you impose, er, oppose this change. Well, is what it is. Use bones for the carbon. Yeah, bones aren't necessarily that great uh, for carbon. They actually should have just used ash. Ash is a much better uh, use uh, to get the carbon, uh, which is what they typically use for the most part. Uh, yeah. Let's see, input good. Yeah, we're missing steel, right? Steel mill. Work. <laughs> it's not like we don't have people. We have peasants here. Qualifications, they're going to slowly trickle in, but they, they get a little bit faster. Go to university. Get a degree. Uh, bones bones are interesting because they're actually uh, a compound of a bunch of different materials. Um, so I, I can't quite answer that because I'm, I'm not an expert in the molecular breakdown of bones. Um, because they may have been desiring additional... Because there's... What originally, for all the steel that we're using in this day and age right here, is low-carbon steel. It uh, It's very brittle. Um, it, you think of, like, your your cast irons. Uh, that's what we basically have at, at this day and age here. Uh, we don't actually have, like, modern-day steel where you're using it for framing of houses. Well. <laughs> that's a little bit of an overgeneralization there, Grape. I mean, <laughs> yes. Uh, we also expire carbon through CO2 and stuff like that. Uh, no heavy gauge yet? No. Uh, no, we are not getting to anything. Uh, like, we're still, like, barely able to cast iron at this day and age. Like, right now, we're in the American Civil War. Uh, those cannons, uh, we're actually, we're technically getting into the rifling stage in mass production uh, of these things. But it's still, it's, casting is still... It's not been very refined at this point. It's still very, rather new, I would say. Uh, not that I'm an expert on the history of uh, refining and stuff like that. I would not claim that whatsoever. I want railways. Yes, 100%. Do I have coal? I have coal in our country. Yeah, yeah, we have coal. No, well, I have coal. We just haven't built up coal. Oh, no, we did. It's only level four. It needs people. Our people are slacking and not doing the jobs that they need. All right, so budget. I'm going to go ahead and increase taxes. Just go ahead and reduce that deficit while we continue to build up. Uh, what is our big expense here? Probably still construction goods. Construction goods got more expensive. Iron is not getting cheaper, even though we're going to produce some more. Uh, let's see how our deficit is doing. Can I just import? No, I can't. Oh, minus 234 convoys. Excuse me? Yeah, we actually are. Oh, no, we're not. It was lying. Okay, I see. Oh, that's because Prussia is no longer being able to give us stuff. Hey, uh, anyone want sugar? I seem to have a... No, no one wants sugar in a, in a bountiful amount. Uh, no furniture, clothes, no. I always find clothes is like the thing that you can never have enough of. 
I'm not gonna buy one iron from Ecuador. That's hilarious. That's that's adorable. Steel? I can get some from Britain. Uh, I'm gonna actually just do that, just because my uh, steel mill isn't uh, producing enough, and if it's not gonna produce, I might as well do it or get it from somewhere else. Where are we using explosives? Hold up. Where where are we using explosives? What building is using explosives? It's got to be a mining operation. Goldfields, no. There's no way. No, you're still fine at softwood. Automation for steam donkey? No, we don't have engines yet. That would be a good use of our steel, though. Gold mines. Increases tool and coal consumption. I don't know that's not going to make that big of a difference. This would be a good way for us to go ahead and relie relie alleviate our, uh, our deficit. This is just going to be more tools, which I, this is a free tech for coal mines because it doesn't increase the cost of coal whatsoever, right? It goes from 100 to only plus 60. So you pay the cost for the coal. You don't, you just don't get as much coal, but you, and it's just extra tools. So it's like, it's kind of a free tech. It's just more tools, which are kind of irrelevant for the most part. Uh, so we're actually going to go ahead and tick that up. I don't care that tools are going to get more expensive because we already have a deficit and we're going to fix that. All right, so you get more tools. Uh, you. You're still fine. Uh, yeah, you're, you're using steel anyway, so we want to do that. And upgrade those probably sooner rather than later. Come to Brazil Imperium. Yes, eventually. Get, have DLCs have uh, had the problem. You know, display, read, wrong info. Yeah. That's something they need to fix. If, if they're putting out games like that, they, uh, I, I take issues and offense to that. Um, th there's been plenty of times where the tooltip is wrong, and it it's frustrating. We're going to delay the arms industry. I don't care about that that much. Uh, it's our army, and we're not going to war anytime soon. At least I don't think so. Yes, I'll piss off the trade unionist. I don't care. Give me my public health insurance. I don't know why people are fighting us on this. Uh, expensive government goods, input shortages on what? Artillery, don't care. Need convoys. Oh, you told me it was, like, it's a thousand now. We have convoys. What is going on with our convoys? This should be, like, recalculating all the time. We have surplus. Paper. Paper is something I would love to import. How much is, how much is our deficit of paper is also a good question. Right? Huge deficit, huge deficit. Paper is a huge deficit as well. Uh, I would like paper mills, please. You have 124,000 people. You ha Why are you not working? You're missing steel. I see. You. No one's working here anymore. I wish to subsidize this. Uh, this just... Increases iron consumption. I and mean, we don't have laborers anyway, so it's not like it matters. Take the 11,000 unemployed and ship them to the steel mills. <laughs> this is what we need. Go work there. I will subsidize it and I will be happy. Uh... The low market access kind of sucks, but that's whatever. What's the Bessemer process? Um, I am not an expert at that. Are you talking... What building are you referring to? I, I don't think I can talk to it. Um, but I don't know until I've seen it. Smoothboards, no. Um, steel mill. Oh, was the steel mill? Um, no, I can't speak to that. I've definitely heard the name before, but that was like five years ago during a university. So I will not say anything on that because I, I, I'm, I don't want to feed you misinformation. <laughs> uh, maybe try to use the edict to encourage pops. Oh, yeah, we can totally accept. Oh, I do have authority, actually. Uh, you guys. I don't like... I, I like the map modes, but also don't like the map modes at the same time. Uh, this is Steel Mill. Go ahead and do an Edict. Decrees. Urge resource? No, we don't need resources. We're good on resources. I would like to go ahead and... Where's the education? There you go. Go there. 
you are doing are you my manufacturing hub i don't think you are my manufacturing hub are you not really this is oh no that's a trade i thought that was my textile mill i was like dang that no this is this is a better manufacturing hub than the other one yeah produce way more out of this get rid of this oh there that's our manufacturing hub Promote social mobility. Yeah, I, I wish to have more. I would like, I'd love more authority. What else would we burn an authority on? I could repeal these taxes to get more authority. Except they give me 16,000 uh, pounds. I almost said euros. They're pounds. They're pounds. Must remember, they are pounds. <laughs> They're going to get more tools. That should help reduce construction. Building this iron mine did not seem to help our uh, price of iron whatsoever. You working it? Yeah, you're working it. You have your appropriate turnaround. Uh, this just costs more tools and coal. I'm down. Give me, give me that little extra oomph. Brazil having more people, not more people is weird. Uh, I mean, we have 6 million people. I don't know how many are in Brazil today. Let's see, market, trade routes. We're doing okay. How's our detail look? Oh, it's only minus 60. Like, steel's fine now. Opium's an issue, except I can't grow opium. So, I, I mean, it's whatever. Um, lead is a small issue. I don't think that necessarily is going to drive up the price too much. Tool Workshop's going to help. Port max size does not matter. It's 200 million? Well, keep in mind, we're 140 years away. Uh, and what is our current birth rate? Population is going up 0.42%. You can tell when we had a little war there. Uh, some, oh no, that was a civil war that happened. That was a, that was a civil war. A little different. Oh. No, I don't really care about that. <laughs> what do we got here? Uh, plus 20 prestige. We have no infamy. Uh, let's see. Can we go to war real quick? Liberate subject. Can I... Oh, I can just go... What is this? Oh, I got... This is two different states for Paraguay. They have 15,000 troops. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so this is actually something here. Uh, I think we're almost close to 400 billion, so we're getting up there. Uh, one of the We're one of the uh, last few develop, or developed countries that still has a positive birth rate. Um, it's only slightly above, to it, above the replacement level. But here we're going to go ahead and conquer this state. This is something that bugs me. Hidden down below here, you have to scroll down even for this. You can add war goal where you can go ahead and say, look... I want to conquer this additional other state for four infamy. So you can do multiple conquests at the same time. Why that isn't... This is the only way you can select multiple war goals at the same time. It baffles me why that's hidden like that. Low market access don't care. States and turmoil don't care. Uh, yeah, we're going to have a, a deficit of you know this stuff. Uh, yeah, I'm going to pick that up from the French with my no convoys that I have, even though I have convoys. Yes. Brilliant. Not a problem. Oh, great. Oh, I forgot my drink in the other room. That's unfortunate. Oh, this stream is looking good, actually. Good. Just double checking. Um, yeah, so this should be a very quick war, assuming no one else joins, which it's possible. Uh, if they do, we may. I may just go to war anyways and just kill them. Because uh, we kill them fast enough, no one, if someone else joining doesn't really make a difference. Uh, we are getting our small ar arms industry afterwards. I will probably need an app for this logging, logging camp. Because this war is going to be a little expensive. Uh, is that they can back down and you don't get any. Really? I did. I was unaware that if they back down, uh, we don't get any of the positive benefits. All right. Um, you lack infrastructure. Your turmoil is probably because of some of that. Uh, we're going to immediately build railroads. Railroads are going to be a huge thing uh, for us right away. Like, anywhere that has, like, over the government capacity can be a huge thing. Railway. Every industrialized area is going to get a railway. It's going to be great. Everyone's going to love it. I would actually prefer to see market or access right now. It is. Hello? It's not under industry. Where where is it? Where where is my uh my uh 
<laughs> I don't like the fact that there is not a tab for construction. It is... Or develop... No. It's under construction. No. Where... I, I, I'm okay with it being there. I just have questions. All right, so you guys are already going to get it. Uh, you need it. You need it as well. Um, eventually, we're just going to end up putting it everywhere. Productivity, sort by that. You're going to get it. You're going to get it. Everyone's going to get it at least once. There you go. We'll go from there. Tech-wise, uh, we're going to hold off on that. We want the water tube boiler, because uh, we're going to try and reform our entire economy here soon. Doesn't look like they're going to back down at all, so. I don't think they can back down when we're declaring war for their land, though. Otherwise, they're just going to concede it, uh, which may or may not be a thing. There you go, to arms. There you go, just start invading. I actually had it. Oh, hey. Where I was at war... Uh, I was doing another test game just to see where, how to do more things and learn. Um, where I had it where I was in two wars at once because I was allied to someone who had a war declared. Um, so I took all the land. They, I was fighting Portugal. Portugal started a colony here. So this went to Portugal as a prov province adjacent. But because I took all of this land before, it created a new front. Portugal landed one troop and they went around like that. And while my army... Uh, had relocated to the other side of Africa over here. Actually, that, that's that's a tidbit. That was, that was the, the Congo game that happened. And it annoyed the crap out of me. I've also had it in a test game where, uh, like, I had a rebellion army that went around and went took my capital and forced me to... I was in two wars because the rebellion spawned. And the rebels forced me to capitulate even though I had conquered all of their capital, but the, they were able to get to my capital and it caused me to break. It flabbergast me because it broke the fronts multiple times. They need to fix the fronts in this game because it recalculates and it breaks things sometimes. And it doesn't... It, it drives me nuts. <laughs> Some things. Like, I think they gave out... Like, they've definitely did a better job than, like, EA when they go ahead and release a new game where it's just literally just garbage. Um, I would say this is probably a B-tier game right now with potential to go to S rank, depending if they can fix the minor things. Like, war? War makes no sense in this game whatsoever. All right, our defense is higher, our offense is a little bit lower, but we have more troops, so we should be able to steamroll, right? We have an advantage of 39. We haven't advanced the front whatsoever. It hasn't changed. The morale is dropping, so we're likely to win. Right, but that's about it. It's not very super consistent. I don't know. Oh, did we take a province? Oh, I think we did take a province. I lied. You just can't tell. That one's definitely taken. Why has that not been taken? I have questions. So many questions. Uh, I definitely need more bureaucrats. Wow, we're back down to 17th rank. I, I definitely don't like, like that. Uh, we definitely need to let all of our construction go through, too, as well. We are making a positive income right now. Construction costs have gone down. Uh, I would like to go ahead and let's go to our budget. You get funded. Actually, you guys get funded a medium. Uh, that should help a little bit. Uh, I would like to repeal one of these if I can, just because it's probably hurting our people immensely. Oh, well, uh, like, okay, so we got a battle here. Eh, well, actually, it wasn't very uh, contested whatsoever. Right? But that created two new fronts. And then... It split our army, but you could all of our army could have been here, and their army was here, even though we literally just fought each other and forced them to uh, move back. How's our legitimacy? Our legitimacy is fine. We're fine. We still have not pa passed public health insurance. Ugh, our people are not allowed to have uh, er, uh, health care whatsoever. Rub some dirt in it, you'll be fine. And go from there. Alrighty. Uh, not going to do anything there. Don't care about the bureaucratic shortfall. Paper needs help. Flotilla, doesn't matter. You need convoys. Uh, also, doesn't matter. Cleared interests. Uh, I'm going to go over here to Congo. I can't colonize anything anyways, uh, because we don't have the tech. Uh, but I'll just throw that over there for now. So. What laws do I have? 
see. Politics laws. Your monarchy, we have wealth voting instead of everyone voting, uh, which is fine. Uh, multiculturalism, which means pretty much anyone can be inside our country without being too pissed off. Uh, freedom of conscience, do whatever you want to do. Uh, religion is not a state mandate. Special army, appointed bureaucrats, uh, national guard. Uh, this basically is like also representatives of the senator, I would imagine, for your bureaucrats uh, for U.S. terms. Tourism, free trade, just so we can have all the trade routes we want, even though we don't have any bureaucrats. Dedicated police force, public schools, we're voting on getting our public health insurance for our health system. Censorship, sorry guys, can't no, no right to assembly for you guys. Serfdom abolished because we don't believe in you owning someone. Child labor is totally allowed. I, it's okay, Jimmy, if you lose your fingers, it's okay. Uh, women are technically considered properties. We're trying to push this through for women's suffrage. Most people like this. Anything beyond that, no. Women are not allowed in the workplace. Or laws just to help out our, our common person. Anyone who is unemployed, doesn't have a job, will help the work yet. Help you out. Migration controls. I don't really want migration controls. I'd prefer to go to no migration, except people are upsetty spaghetti. Um, and then slavery's banned because that's a given. No one should have the right to own someone else. And the war is over. Thank you for joining us, Paraguay. Uh, what do you got here? See, now it's only one state here. Instead of it was two. Oh my gosh, you've developed this to no end. You have a... What is going on here? Why is there so many people? <laughs> Population. 700,000 in this little itty bitty place? Oh my gosh. Uh, we need we need to help you. I like the textiles. I like the furniture. Arms industry is not required. Uh, we don't need that. We're, we're gonna do that ourselves. Uh, logging camps, iron mines are good. We're gonna get rid of these barracks. You guys are not allowed to try and rise up whatsoever. Uh, we got lots of plantations, okay. Uh, it also looks like we're just, like, drastically unemployed. Is that what I'm seeing here? Look, we're just ahead of times. It's totally cool. Uh, dyes, tobacco, cotton, all that seems fine. I'd prefer you guys go work in, like, the tool shops and stuff. Oh, you guys, oh my gosh. Go use steel. What are we doing for our buildings? Ports. Uh, I, don't, I would like the additional convoys. Uh, we're gonna ignore that for now, though. On scripts, uh, just go skirmishers. That's fine. Obviously, go for first. Go for that's expensive, regardless. Uh, go with that. Uh, get rid of the opium. We don't need opium. Our people uh, don't get don't get addicted to drugs. Is basically what we're doing. Power of the purse. Might as well do that. That's okay. That one. What do we got here? This requires more tools. That's fine. Maze. Uh, go with the main crop. Slightly rich. Looks like they were a little bit behind time in terms of tech. Iron mines. Atmospheric pump is fine. We didn't get any coal mines, unfortunately. You guys stick with that. Rail transport. We don't have any uh, rail yet, so. That is good. Uh, I'm good with that right now. Do you guys need to swap over? No, electric is not something we have. Alrighty, let's see our production. Urban buildings, urban centers. I'm torn. I don't. I don't particularly care one way or another. Um, with that, free churches. State rent. No, free churches are fine. Uh, public transport is not something we can afford. We have the coal for this. We do indeed have coal. There you go. Go and give them those services. Services. Uh, what do you guys got? Sure, mechanized seems fine. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. With luxury, that's fine. Textile mill, I don't... Th oh, we do have dyes now, but we can go for sewing machines. Use that steel, use the mechanized loom, great. We're just going to industrialize all of Paraguay at one time. Universities. Um, it's going to cost us paper, that's fine though. I want you guys to upgrade sooner. Clerical seems fine as well. There we go. Dangerous equipment. More people die. Yeah, I mean, they die. It is what it is. We're not even fighting unproductive trade routes for tools. That's fine. We can... Oh, we're still doing... Wait, why do I have so many tools now? Hold up. I have 100 tools? Fantastic. Love it. 
Iron we still have in supply. Steel needs some help still. Disappearing interest, that's fine. I, I don't care. Steel mill? Steel mill is still not being worked. <laughs> the steel mill still is the bane of my existence. It's not even... Pro oh, it's missing coal. Hold up. We, we, we can fix the coal issue. You have no peasants. You have peasants? You can, you can have one. Give us that coal. Uh, how about you? You can have some coal. You can have a one whole peasant uh, working on that. Uh, you can have a couple. Give us three. You're missing coal. Yeah. We're going to put those coal mines at the top. Top priority. We're going to need lots of coal now. We're a coal economy. No oil for us. It's coal, baby. Good, clean coal, right? Uh, institutions. Oh, we got lots. You're going to upgrade it. What, what is this? There's so many institutions. We can technically colonize, but that's not helping. Minus 5% mortality is nice. Way more bureaucrats are needed. Hold up. Paraguay, would you have in here? You did not have any. You need coal. That's fine. Coal is going to be a deficit for a little while. I'm not too concerned about that. It's that. Actually, you don't even have people to work that. Never mind. Sugar plantation. Uh, we already overproduced this, so get rid of that. Going to race in Connecticut with the same two guys getting at it again. I mean, hey. Did you guys pulls close, I'm assuming, at that point, then? That's going down. Do we have more trade routes I don't need? Succession movement. Wait, what? Where's this at? You're Catholic? Where? Oh, it's in Paraguay. We literally just took it. Don't mind us. Uh, I don't have the bureaucrats to uh, go ahead and add you guys. So, otherwise I would. States in turmoil. We're going to ignore that. Relax. What are we using engines for? Hold up. Get those from America. I'm curious what the engines are for. 8 p.m. they close. Okay. So relatively soon. Fusion, textile mills. Like, I wish the pop-up would go away once you're already a tier above. Uh, it shouldn't make a difference. When do we get a munitions facility? We always have that? May have. I may have just ignored it. Public trans. Good. Give us those extra services. Uh, I still need more paper in my life. I also need uh, chemical plants so we can actually make explosives. Except I don't have sulfur. Paraguay, do you have sulfur? That's a great question. I swapped over. I don't need more iron, ironically. Oh! Oh, we're getting coal from from America. Dang, that's a... Uh, I, I guess we'll get it from France, too. I don't care about our bureaucrats, that's fine. It's just lowering our overall taxes, which is whatever. We make enough money anyways. You have some people. We're also going to make our own coal. Textile mills just make so much money. You get two more of those. Enjoy. Use all of your people. Um, there we go. Let me see. What do we got? Textile mills are going to be helpful. That's not an issue. Railways. Oh, I do have barracks there. I want to take the barracks away here so when they rebel, they don't have people uh, to try and fight me. Iron Mine has coal. You're still lacking. Oh, you're lacking transportation. Almost as if... Oh, I thought we already did all of our infrastructure. Oh, no. Okay. We took the coal mines and pushed them forward, which is fine because we need that. That is something we need. I'm actually going to push you guys forward and then drop you specifically down behind that guy. There you go. Do something like that. Cascading. Construction cost has gone down 5k. That's very nice to see. Diplo packs. Hold up. Why are Diplo packs? Is that from our vassals, I'm assuming? Argentina for being our dominion. Minting is good. Cons consumption taxes. I would like to get rid of that eventually. Government goods. Paper has gone up. I mean, sure. Artillery, small arms, ammunition, and mineral arms. Okay. Interest going down. Welfare payments. That's for our people. We care about our people, and so we will pay them. And we can go ahead and reduce the spending on our uh, military. Drop that down for additional 3k. Uh, I have no idea. I like. I wish you should be able to... Oh, that came to us. We got people from Africa who just came and joined us. Like... This, this should, I should be able to click that and tell me where... Point to where it is, because I don't know what all these states are called. Uh, that would be a good thing. Transportation. You can't import this, though, unfortunately. Which means I probably want to go ahead and repeal this. Yeah, repeal that. We'll get that later once we actually have transportation available. <laughs> right, 
rule. You guys are fine. Transportation will be something we are going to do later. Uh, for a lot of this stuff. You're still giving us hardwood. Is there anything on the market that we need? I don't want this. Russia will take it. We give it to Russia then. And I just need more bureaucrats, which will just fall in line later. That won't be an issue. Not be an issue whatsoever. All right, let's go see our diplomatic actions, because we haven't actually looked at this yet. Anyone wish to join? Netherlands? Colombia doesn't want it. Are you sure you don't want it? No, you don't. Ecuador? I said, like, I also wish they put on here uh, the total value of what it ends up being. Sao Paulo. That's us. Why are we, like, I understand we're multiculturalism, but I was not expecting to go ahead and get all these people. I, I, I appreciate that. Uh, so you, you're currently inside of our node, but you should be able to just declare war. I owe you an obligation. We have a defensive pact. All of that is true. Andrew regime can't vacillate. I can puppet someone. I don't really care about puppeting these people. Wow, we're getting a lot of people. Just for subjects. It's not making a difference. Like, that's... That's... Four migrations very quickly. All right, we're, 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 wait, weren't we at like four and a half million earlier? Or where, where are we at? Yeah, we, we're having a big, big tick up there for migrations. Okay. I mean, I, I won't complain about that. It's more people for me to, to have work. Convoys, unproductive. Don't bother giving me steel anymore because I produce it our. I hope we produce it ourselves. Nope, steel mill's still not working. We have more people joining us. I was here. Good, I mean, I didn't have enough people here anyways. Upgrade that again. There you go. Uh, except we, we definitely need more bureaucrats. We're wasting 13% of our taxes right now. I mean, that's like three grand. It's a bit. It's a bit much. See our market. This is calming down a little bit. Uh, okay, don't give me any more ammunition. That's fine. I believe I have my own plant as well. Not there. Trade Center needs people. I mean, this has a level 2 university. I, I, I would feel that's fine. Arms industry probably needs a little bit of help. Probably doing mixed. Cannons. Yeah, we're mixed right now. Uh, it seems fine. We're not running into a deficit. Cans are a little expensive, though. You're getting your railway eventually. Cool. I'd say we're fine. We're just chilling. Sitting pretty. Wait, hold up. What is this? Who are you fighting? Ito Kingdom. This is over here. Isn't it? No, I have no idea where this is. Where are you? They're fearless? Uh, I don't think you want to be fearless. You. I, I need to be able to click on a flag and just go to. Like, ar. <laughs> Let me go to. That's your way. Yakut migration. Okay, cool. I mean, I'm down for people. People need to come. Our, uh... Okay, radicals are going down. I, that's at least good. Landowners are going to be upsetty spaghetti for a while. Uh, are we giving anything of our uh, authority elsewhere? Collecting taxes, social mobilization. Wow, we need a lot more uh, authority. Authority would be great. We've got rifles. You guys are trying to progress. You're just not going to be able to. Uh, what is this? This is welfare. I don't really care about that, though. I'm going to repeal one of these. I think I'm going to repeal services. We're going to help our people out by uh, repealing one of these taxes and give me a lot more authority. There you go. And with that newfound authority, we're going to continue to increase our production. Where do we produce all of our coal? 
um here i would love you guys for you guys to go ahead and get people turmoil is a little high i'd like to reduce that a little bit more this is a manufacturing location this is the big one enlistment effort no road maintenance stick construction uh i mean stick construction is not bad but i'm not gonna dip that around anywhere education access is fine incorporate states you're still not done how long have you been working on incorporating this state four years granted i, I definitely don't have the bureaucrats to spend on it <laughs> Lose a lot of Mouser rifles for decades. I don't know which rifle the Mouser is, though. Unfortunately. Uh, dynamite is something I would like eventually. I don't think I need any of that stuff, though. I don't. I don't think we need any production. Um, we have pharmaceuticals. We can technically go colonize since uh, we have this already, so we can go colonize technically. Definitely could. Do that. Let us go see our diplomacy declared actions. We kill that one and go over here to Congo. We should be able to colonize. Establish colony. Do not have produce any colonial growth. Excuse me? Oh, we don't actually have that for colonial growth. We have home affairs. Okay. Well, that means we need to go do colonial interve intervention for our laws. Laws, baking, don't care about Shh, colonial affairs. Colonial exploitation. We're going to start colonizing. The Senate is more closer than I thought. Oh, uh, I mean, what was the original polls supposed to say for the Senate? Because that I am curious about how the Senates are going for everyone, because that's the hot topic for the U.S., is uh, who's going to retain the control of the uh, Senate? Unproductive coal. Yes, that's because we manufacture ourselves. Anyone want wood? I'm, I'm good with selling wood. Uh, yeah, we're going to sell it to Mexico. At a nice, healthy premium. Export cloth to anyone? Yep, we'll sell that to Mexico as well. Mexico's trying to develop. I have plenty. Fruit. Uh, not so much. How about meat? Also, no. Let's see our market. Fine, stop giving me your steel. It's if I care about that. Uh, wow, we produce a crap ton of gold. Wood's good. Let's go see the other other side. Furniture, cloth, and coal. These are our four goods that we need to work on. Furniture is a, a big thing for us that we want to focus on. Well, we're getting our railroads out, which are good. Why are you guys so upset? Taxation waste is never good. You have available people. I think I want to go ahead and get a... I think I want one of these. Or a couple of those, actually. Go get three of them there. Uh, that should give us enough bureaucrats, hopefully. Minnesota has been a Democratic stronghold for the longest time. I mean, I live in Michigan. We flip-flop every four years, pretty much. It used to be blue, and now we're flip-flopping. We're basically a purple state. What are we using straight steamers for? No consumption. Yeah. There's no consumption. Why is the steamer even popping up? Not used anywhere. I mean, I, I can't, I, I don't necessarily pay attention that much to elections. I, I think they're fun to watch just because people get really upset uh, if their candidate doesn't won, win, regardless of which side you're on. Uh, I, I pretty much just watch it for humor. <laughs> I'm one of those people. Uh, I like watching chaos. Chaos is fun to me. <laughs> uh, you have plenty of people. I'm fine with keeping the sugar plantation, though it doesn't make us anything. I'd much rather do uh, infrastructure. Is uh, actually, we could probably do that if we went for a uh, food industry. Food industries actually make quite a bit of sense for us. Uh, we'll probably want that up to tier three because that's how we're going to feed our people. We're going to get grocery stores. It's going to be great. We're going to love grocery stores. 
don't forget if you guys are enjoying this content that you guys go ahead and leave a like down in, in the uh live stream because it helps uh the youtube algorithm for more people to find the channel which means as the channel grows i can spend more time and more resources on you guys um so it's kind of a uh, a feedback loop if you will is the u.s at war with mexico hold up they're embargoed Prime relation alliance what was obligation no you're not at war you 100% are at war. I'm literally looking at this. US is invading Mexico and Mexico is invading. That's fun. What is this war for? There's that little Yankee. You guys got mud. Okay, that's fun. Um, You're using conscripts versus actual troops in the Mexican army. Only looks what that was quick. Hold up. You need to go colonize first. Establish colony. We're going to Congo, guys. We're going to Congo. Uh, this one's pretty quick. Ooh. We have to race people. Go colonize that. We'll be faster. Good. Because the more you colonize, the slower your growth rate is. So we're actually going to be able to get this first. So we're going to colonize there. Yo, and we should have more, uh, more policies that we can go ahead and do uh, for colonial expansion. What do I need for this one? I have to have bureaucrats. Yeah, bureaucrats aren't a thing right now. They're, we just don't have any. They're 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 in short supply. What is this? Okay, more bureaucrats. Good, good, good. <laughs> so, bureaucrats will be good. Won't be an issue. Is there anywhere else we really want to fight? I don't think so. I think we're kind of taking a little chill chill for a moment. Um, I don't need more radicals in my life. I already have two million radicals. That's twenty eight percent of our entire population is considered a radical. Don't need that in my life. Uh, I also need to spend this. Uh, our decrees. We need to spend this. Uh, what do you produce? You produce a lot of res raw resource. Actually, isn't that meant that much? Although I would like to get the additional gold. Uh, give me that extra twenty percent on gold. Sounds good. I hope that impacts the gold. Just more output of gold. Sounds fantastic. You have plenty of people. We're going to go ahead and do resource there because you are going to be a coal center is what I'm thinking. Uh, give us another three. The munitions facility needs a little bit of help. Why? It's because we're not at war. We have a surplus. Probably. And that's pretty much all of our authority spent. Camera for five prestige. Don't really care about that. No, we're not going socialist. I... I hate socialism. It is a phenomenal concept in theory. In theory, yeah. Once you once it goes into application, it's horrible. Um, uh, let's give us electricity. That sounds pretty good. Uh, that gives us lots of services and amenities that I would love to give to our people. I can rant about socialism for a long time. Uh, about how it works and why. Why it's theoretically good, but practically bad. Uh, do I need this? No, I don't need this. Everyone can have tobacco. It's fine. That's good. We're fine here. This seems to be going down, which I appreciate. Uh, no, don't even bother taking that up. That's fine. That's too expensive. Uh, the next thing that we're going to do is reduce our taxes. Uh, so our radicals shift a little bit faster. And we're losing radicals right now, which I appreciate. So. It doesn't even feel like we're getting any, any of these guys coming in are we just missing that much paper there's extra 1300 bureaucrats doing this i don't think i need 1300 bureaucrats uh maybe 450 sounds pretty good i did the click and it did not make a difference <laughs> that is what that felt like to me uh you give me a standardized filing system there we go positive bureauc oh no we're just fixing it everywhere just get everything go there. There we go. We have positive bureaucrats. It's glorious. Everything's going to start trending up. Why do you... You're missing, what, paper? Yeah, paper is a resource that uh, we definitely need. I wish to import an abundance of paper from the Dutch economy. If I need more, I'm going to come over here to the Spanish economy. <laughs> uh, yeah, stop receiving that. That seems good. 100%, we're going to go get paper from the, the Spanish. Spain, England, I will take your entire supply. Oh, you only have 22? That's unfortunate. No, okay, there's 148. Good. <laughs> I will take your entire... How are we having... Yeah, I was like, we don't have this. I'm looking at 145 of these people. 
Uh, paper mills uh, are needed everywhere. I need hundreds more paper. <laughs> uh, I don't necessarily. I don't know if I produce enough for that. Uh, we'll definitely do the sweeteners and the grain. That's fine. Baking powder seems fine. Um, this produces liquor and groceries. I don't think we produce glass, uh, so we're gonna hold off on that. I don't think we produce glass at all. No, I don't produce glass. So that is, we definitely need glass though. If we're gonna upgrade these guys to the next tier, we're market squares. Yeah, glass it is. Uh, so we're gonna actually upgrade you to use uh, this real quick, and then we're gonna go build some glass, which is gonna require lead, which is fine. You have available peasants. I'm good with that. Give us three in the glass. Each tier is one. Give us four. Four should be fine. I like the positive income right now. That's actually pretty nice. Budget, we're going to go ahead and drop that down. Save us a little bit extra cash. Or don't necessarily save us cash. Save our people cash. So that way, uh, they are not... Oh, this is ticking down pretty quick for radicalism. What do you want? And not cultural exclu... No, we're not doing cultural exclusion. That's the exact opposite of what we're trying to do here. Uh, I would like to decrease our mortality rate by a lot. I would appreciate that. I would also appreciate uh, faster colonies. Sounds good to me. Um, you uh, need to be integrated for 116. Go ahead and take that click as well. It's in turmoil. Why? You're at 27%. That's not turmoil, please. We've had so much worse. I don't care about that a little bit. Buildings. I'm getting a railway. I think extra construction yards at this point is probably beneficial. Our economy is fine. Big enough to support it. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. I don't have one here, actually. logging. I don't think I care about. Oh, no, I do. I have two. Give me two more. Build those pretty quick. Space. For this game, mechanics, choose what works best and it's different from what you want. Simple. It's more fascism than the best, but everyone can agree that it really is the worst. <laughs> yes. Um, that's why, like, socialism works great, because this is a hunt game based on 100% theoretical. Uh, so it works. Uh, but for terms of roleplay purposes, I still will not go communist. I don't care what the meta is. I don't care. We will figure it out ourselves, and if we can, we're going to break the meta. Um, which, I have no idea what the meta actually is. I'm pretty sure it's just build paper and you'll be fine. Uh, but it's paper, iron, and steel, and coal. If you can do those four things, you're pretty good. Oh, and, and I guess wood, too, for early game. But wood will eventually get phased out, so it's like meh. Market, trade routes. We have, oh, we have lots of steel, apparently. Uh, then ex export that to Russia, even though we don't have convoys, because that's what it's telling me. How are our ports doing? Shipbuilding. That requires engines. We don't have engines. Engines aren't a thing. Um, we should be able to do this, except for the fact that we don't have enough steel. You need sulfur. We don't have... We can do that, though. Give us the boiler. Yeah, we can do that. That's fine. Give us that little extra bump in paper. It just makes it more efficient. What do you want? Enter a trade agreement. Yes, I will 100% accept that with you, France. I have no problem with that whatsoever. It sounds great. Rifles. We can do that as well. I don't see an issue. Reduce our iron consumption. Another migration. Great. Perfect. Love it. Uh, public transport still not a thing for us. Oh, rule development. Anything here? It just doesn't produce that much. Brazilians obsessed with tobacco. Guys, tobacco is bad for you. I don't know how to explain that to you. <laughs> no, it's okay. Wow, you guys are angry. Why are you so angry? What happened to you guys? Um, no colonial affairs and colonial expand exploitation. Uh, you guys are gonna hopefully be moved to a marginalized group, so I don't have to even worry about you. Yeah, no, I don't care what you guys have to say. We're multiculturalism, and we're gonna continue expanding, and we're colonizing. We're over here, somewhere. The Dutch are here, evidently. Yeah, this is where we gotta colonize here. I'm curious how this 
colony stuff actually works because I haven't done it yet. Like, there's already people there. Oh, is this this is our little colony? Interesting. You just slowly expand out. Interesting. I'm taking this little portion, I think. No, this pit's mine. I can already build stuff here? Oh. It has 2,000 peasants. There's not a single job they can do. Ah. Right. Uh, arms industry throughput. Migration attraction. Nah, give me repeaters. I'd rather have tech. Yeah, I just repealed that, though, on the, uh... On the tobacco. Our people love it, and I wasn't gonna tell them no. <laughs> they can have it. I, I want... I want the radicalists to go away. Uh, and I feel like that's probably one of the best ways to do that. Like, affects radicalism on interest groups. Has on all those. So, like, our intelligentsia is minus three because uh, they're so radical. Interesting. Taxes are fine. I'm not too concerned about it. I don't even bother paying people. I don't... This just makes the intelligentsia and gives you more prestige. I, I don't care, right? Makes the military. It's the, it doesn't make your military more effective. It's just what you pay them. Um, it probably has a hidden modifier for the rate. In, oh, yeah, there you go. Training time. Plus 100%. Does that mean it's indefinitely or it's just double? I don't know. Because the progress is minus 100%. It's not going to progress, right? What resource are you missing? Are you missing coal? I'm assuming it's coal. Let me guess. Coal? Yeah. Oh, we need engines. Engines is not something we have. Hold the front door. We need... You don't have... No, I'm not going to build this in the steel mill. The steel mill finally has people in it. I'm not going to throw that for a, a wrench. Uh, you have a university. Give me... I need engines. I need engineers is what I need. Give me motor industries. Give me two of those. Uh, that's going to be a hot commodity real quick. You have literally no one. Fantastic. Leave this. We don't care about this. <laughs> Get rid of the fishery. We don't need them. Go go work in the iron mines. That sounds like a much more appropriate job. Uh, cotton mine. Plantation. Get rid of it. We don't need that. It's a useless good. Go work in the iron mine. Gives us 5,000 people right here. Right here. They're waiting for it. There you go. Good job, guys. But no, no. You were unemployed. Go back into the, the mines. The mines is where you belong. Expensive good paper? I can only imagine why. Can I buy more paper? No, I don't have enough bureaucrats anyways. Isolated state region. Well, that's because it's my African province. Of course it's isolated. It doesn't even have a port yet. I'm not going to build a port for a while. Yeah, we're low on engines. That's fine. I'm going to get that from the French. And the British. I need to work in all of my... Uh, I mean, it's still early in the voting. It could go either way. Uh, right? I mean, look, you have to look at what percentage is in and what districts are in for it to actually mean anything at this point. The polls just, like, the polls in Texas probably just closed, like, eight minutes ago. So, in that regard. Uh, you can lose popularity. I don't care. Oh, uh, what do you got here? Fire him. I mean, sure, fire him. I don't care. Wait, wait, one general is perfectly... I actually need a second general. He cannot uh, field a large enough army. Here. How old are you? You're 63. We're going to promote you. You seem to be... I mean, you haven't disappointed me yet. Let me put it that way. Law and order. What do you got? I don't even know what party this is. Hold up. Government. Uh, I like the progressive league is what I currently have in power. We have a very large progressive league. <laughs> <laughs> Even though ha some of our people are very happy and some of our people are very upset. Uh, that's okay, though. I don't mind. Uh, we don't currently have any laws being passed. Is there anything any everyone just, like, all agrees on is good as a whole? Migration controls? No migration controls? I'd love this, except... Rule f like, why do the rule folk are upset about that? Property women? We're not going to legal guardianship. Censorship? Right to assembly will eventually. Monarchy? 
I don't care about a monarchy, to be honest. It's whatever. Freedom. Total separation will be eventually, except uh, the Catholics are... Ups Why are the armed forces against it? I feel like they would be kind of be on the fence. Professional army. We're not going for mass conscription. National militia. What does that give us? Reduced armed forces political strength. Okay. Can mobilize 181 battalions. Yeah, I don't want that many. I don't want that many people. National Guard. Yeah, I'm fine with that. I don't think there's anything wrong with a National Guard. Thing here. Command economy. I, I don't want that, but we, we could definitely go towards that. Interventionalism. I mean, I, I, I can only subsidize our agricultural goods. I don't want to subsidize our agricultural goods. I don't care about those. Per capita taxation? Proportional taxes? No. I mean, most people are good with this. I'm okay with that. We can restrict child labor laws. They, why are the industrialists... And I understand that you want more people to work there, but, like, hey. That education sounds pretty good to me. Reduces dependent incomes? Yeah, I, I think that's fine. One interest group, one interest group is enough. For the children, we will help them. Unproductive freight routes. Yeah, I get rid of them. No longer getting explosives. Oh, that's a shame. We can export steel. Who wants steel? France? Take it. Enjoy your 150 steel that I overproduce. We overproduce dyes. Dyes are dirt cheap for us. Go sell it to the Dutch economy. Sounds good. I need more bureaucrats too now again. Uh, I'm not going to bother selling it. I need more coal in my life, apparently. I really don't want my fruit anymore, either. I really overproduce iron as well. Coal's our big thing. What are we missing here? Hold up. Why? why what are you missing? Oh, we just have an input good shortage on coal. Alright, coal is the topmost priority right now. Hold up. Hold the front door. Coal needs overproduced. There you go. Go do that. Coal is the number one priority. <laughs> Without coal, bad things will happen to our economy pretty quick. Uh, it'll shut down our steel, iron production. I Actually, I think that's about it, being realistically. Uh, I think that's it. I need more bureaucrats, though, again, which is almost excessive how much paper we need. Get it from the French economy. I don't care what it does to our bureaucrats. Doesn't seem like it became an issue to our bureaucrats all of a sudden. All right, let's see. Buildings. Coal mine. Um, yes, do that. Produce even more. Just cost us people, which is fine. Uh, steam donkeys, no. Cost engines. Rail transport, yep, get that online. We're starting to get that. Oh, that's, hold up, that's the wrong one. You don't do that. You do that here. <laughs> this is important there. Uh, steam donkeys are probably worth it here. Cost us some engines. That's okay. We'll, we'll get our engines online soon. You want to do anything? No. We're 100% legitimacy. Everything else can go away. I don't care. Uh, I would like to make you a little bit happier and a little bit, you a little bit happier as well. Other than that, I think we're doing okay. Radicals are going down. It actually kind of looks like they're going up. Yeah, they are going up. Budget's fine. Gold reserves are just teetering up and down. That's fine. We were in a deficit. Oh, no, that was... Yeah, no, we were in a deficit. Now we're, like, breaking even. We're fine. How is construction goods doing? Need more iron. Excuse me? Save me those bureaucrats. What do you got here? Uh, How many are you giving me? That is a lot from Columbia. Uh, that is not much. We don't need that little bit. We're getting over a thousand grain from Colombia. Dang. Uh, food. We're giving them 135 food or wood, which is fine. Um, France and Mexico are paying us pretty handsomely. Got more migrants. Good. Coffee. I'll get rid of that one. That's not really worth anything. Uh, the U.S. and uh, Chile are where the coffee uh, boon is from. Fabric. Is good sugar is really good for us. Uh, you guys are fine. 
I'm only giving 45 and a half. I wish I could give a little bit more tobacco. Importing, importation's fine. About oh, fertilizer. Dyes, how are you looking? Fine, okay. Coal. I mean, yeah, we gotta do what we gotta do. I, I don't actually want to import that eventually. Why, why do we even have these two? I would like to, to end these. Oh, that's their trade route with us? I don't want those. Furniture is fine. Small arms is fine. Engines, good. Steel. That one's not too good. We'll, we'll pull that back from France. No one, everyone, no, no. This is a timeline where Brazil doesn't even do coffee. It's not even worth. Uh, we're importing from you guys. It's good. Ammunition's fine. How are we doing here? I think we're all good. This change, this can't even change that, so we're good. Brazilian coffee is not a thing for us. <laughs> it's not meant to be a thing. Did I uh, give you guys a, uh, a railroad? No, you definitely need one. Uh, dyes not producing very much. But man, those furniture factories, dang! Look at the amount of money those furniture factories make. That's ridiculous. Place the coffee with coal. Yes, that's right. We're going to sell something else. That's a... I'm not even going to say what I was going to say. But yes, get rid of those coffee beans. We need that coal. Sweet, sweet coal. What do we got here? Sure. We're going to get those child labor laws. I don't care. We deserve them for the, ki for the children. The children are our future, and so we must prepare them for the future. I don't know. Black convoys. I feel like that's a lie. Black engines. I'm trying to import them as fast as I can, so... And we're actually trying to build them, too. Air construction. Uh, I, I definitely built these things, didn't I? I, I? I don't like the fact that it doesn't go away. I feel like I can click around forever and never find them. That's the ammunition facility. Go buildings. Uh, yeah, I can literally could click around forever. Uh, you're fine. I don't even want the dye workshops. It's not even worth my time. You... Yes. That. Automation? Yes. We need even more furniture. <laughs> Glass works. Uh, we don't have any lead, so that's not a thing for us. Automation here? Not quite. Paper... No, I don't have sulfur. I don't use enough steel yet. Where, where, I, you guys are, in, I, you're in the list. I missed you. Where are you on the list? I don't. Am I missing the engines? Like. We have food industry, or is it, like, down the line? Alright, we're gonna get rid of some of these railways. Okay, it's down the line. We're gonna get rid of some of these railways. They're causing me issues with, uh, with coal. Coal, oh, there's our motors. Hold up. Go to the top. There, you guys are a little bit more important than coal, even. <laughs> Give me those engines. I don't know why they cap uh, how many things you can have listed here. I, w I want to scroll all the way down to the bottom. I don't think I did that. Screw that. No one wants our iron. Not a good enough supply. Fabric? Fabric is just something we have oodles of. We'll sell it to the Dutch. Sell it to the Chile people as well. Uh, they don't cost me convoys. Fruit? No one wants fruit. Okay. That's fine. But you're still being colonized. It says 432. Is that to get the next province here? Because it's a growing colony. Yeah, lose the authority. I don't care. We're not using it anyways. 
Sure does need convoys. I don't believe it. Paper is expensive. Well, we're going to work on that later. <laughs> <laughs> Paper's whatever. Um, you guys are fine. Our big expense is what? Iron? Didn't I produce a crap ton of iron? Yeah, it's something we're willing to export. Same with steel. Like, we, we produce an ample amount. It's, I understand we have to pay for it, but like... A moderate amount. This will be... Oh, we're going to need glass for that. And explosives. But we other than that, we produce everything. So, that actually won't be too bad when we upgrade to that. Alright, well, we need more bureaucrats because, you know... Okay, you're, you're just out of people. And the Iron Man is going to drop, so we're going to leave that as is. I want to downgrade this one time. Reduce the people. Reduce the people. There you go. Cost additional units, units, but uh, these engines are going to start coming online. They're going to come on hot and fast. Uh, how many of you guys can actually produce? No building consumption yet. Well, apparently there's 5,000 of these in the world. No, I think that's out of all factories. It's going to be the, the number 31, even though it doesn't exist yet. It'll be 31 in the world for uh, productivity, which is kind of funny. Uh, yeah, we can do that. That's fine. Give me child labor laws. I'll be happy. Are you guys not producing the arms industry? Where are you at? No, you're not big enough. Then give me that. You lacking anything? Nope. You just don't produce enough cannons. Okay. Smooth bores. Do it. We produce enough steel. There we go. Yeah, look look at the price of steel. It's it's dirt. You know, hardwood is far more expensive. Let's go buildings. Uh, let's go find more of our lumber. It'd be in the rules section, because that's where it's at. You guys. Looking for like another small little one. Hardwood, you, you're already on hardwood. How about you? You can do hardwood because you're tiny. You can also do that. There you go. Actually, do we just want to do that as a whole? No, okay. Oh, that's like minus 82. That's like nothing. Um, Because, I mean, we'll split it. Nah. I don't think we produce enough regular wood, would we? We don't produce enough food anymore. Oh, no. Yeah, we go into a, a deficit. So, we're fine there. Lead is net zero. Clippers, engine units are deficit. Explosives are deficit. We'll get fertilizer, but I don't have any ammonia, unfortunately. Yep, no ammonia. No sulfur, not ammonia. Those are a little different. Uh, is there anything left here? Can I go declare war for... Uh... No, we have a defensive pack. We're going to get rid of that. You. Uruguay. Interactions. And defensive pact. You're right. Get rid of that. Get kicked out. There you go. Get out. We have a truce now, right? I own ob How do I get rid of an obligation? Can't imagine why I would want to owe them an obligation. Great. GB got the Balkan Islands. I think these are no. What, what islands are these called? These these islands are special. Uh, because Great Britain gets into a couple fights about these islands. These aren't the Balkan. What what islands are these? Uh, it's not this. Just location. I want to know what this island is called because GB has had a war over this. Wait, what is this? Whales? Whaling industry. I didn't know you could do whaling. Oh my god, you can do whaling. For oil? I want this island for whales. I want the... I want the whales. <laughs> Let's be realistic. Wait, can you go whaling over here in Iceland? Is that a thing? Because this was like a big industry over here. No, I don't want the market. I, I went to see the actual state. There's whales! You can have a whole economy on whales! I 
Uh, Fisher is a little less fun. Why is there no whaling over here? Hold up. Whoa. This is a whole new thing. What is this? National Harbor. I mean, isn't that pretty much all of the island? Everything's a natural harbor? That's kind of the point of an island? You're... No, I'm just kidding. Why is this one a natural harbor and none of these other ones? Like, anything here is considered would be considered a natural harbor. Is, is London a natural harbor? Okay, it is. Okay. Game crash? I think it crashed. It did crash! Oh, no! Wow. Uh, apparently, me clicking on GB uh, kills the game. Alrighty, well, bear with me one second while I uh, I uh, go ahead and uh, just go back to that real quick while we wait for the game to come back online. America can do whaling? Okay, we gotta go to the Boston area. Um, I think the colonies grow based on if you're malaria protection. Axis. Um, I believe the growth is actually on your uh, institution that you have for that growth. Um, it dictates how much you actually give. Right now we're doing 0.1 because we don't have enough bureaucrats to go up above that. Um, but I believe that's how that works. Again, I am not an expert in colonizing. This is actually the first colony I've ever done. So <laughs> that's just based off what I've read. Um, so we'll see. Let's see. Do, do. I'm just checking up on the polls real quick just because I'm curious. Um, I don't think there's any surprises right now in anything. Next poll is closed in three minutes. Just because I'm curious. Florida has already predicted that DeSantis won. That's very early in the night. Uh, let's see what else we got. Yeah, Mark Rubio also won for the Senate. That's... I mean, the polls for this for Florida was uh, over 10 for DeSantis, but that's funny if they're already calling that without even... They voted kind of votes for an hour. So, that's not that long. We'll see. Sorry, we're also waiting for the game to load. It's not on my solid state drive. It's on my normal hard drive, so it takes a little longer to load, unfortunately. I guess I can throw an ad in real quick. I will be right back. I also never know how long these ads are. Like, is it, it how long is the ad for you guys? I don't know if actually the ad actually cuts over everything I'm saying right now. Technically, I'm curious, curious what you guys say when we get there. Also, what did I do in the game that caused it to crash? <laughs> I was just trying to find whales. <laughs> Interesting. I throw an ad and all the if you guys leave everyone leaves. Like, oh, ad. Get rid of it. <laughs> oh well. We'll see. There you go. We can go and continue already. Fantastic. I don't know what killed the game. Oh well. Uh, let's go see where is OBS. OBS, where are thou? Two inch. Go there. Are you not finding the game? Any oh, there it goes. Okay, good. So, how long is the ad for you guys when it goes? I'm just curious on that because I I don't actually get to see the ads myself. Market access there is... Where is this? This is my colony. I, I don't know why there's no market access there. Is it because there's no port? That's the answer. I understand. Trade routes got convoys. Input goods. We need more opium. I don't care about opium. Why have so much turmoil? Why? Why are you upset? No one's upset over here. Why are you upset over here? Poor working conditioners or something? No, you guys all get paid nicely. I wish you would remember this as well. Mine was like a minute with a five second skip ad. Interesting. I never understand the ads. They also, the amount you get paid depending on the ad changes a lot too. Um, so that doesn't always make sense either. Balance. Lots of fabric, lots of wood. I don't think we have that much fabric production. I didn't think we built that much. Uh, 
pot production. I don't think I have any cotton production now that I'm thinking about it. Where, where are we getting all of our fabric from? No production. Here. Okay, we, we have seven. Okay, seven times 40. Okay, that gets up there. That's 280, and we're not using that much, probably. Although, it just it is coming in with a nice supply. 366. Alright, we get produce all of our cotton in one lo location. If locusts were to hit that one location, our cotton production and fabric production is zero. Fantastic. What do we got here? Uh, turmoil, don't care about that. Flotilla and reserve. Sure, this guy's going to be in Congo instead, because why not? Dockyard. Black consumption? Sure, you do that. Patrol coast. Sure. Do whatever you need. All right, let's go see over here for our colony, though. Progression uh, increased by 0.08 per day. Colonial growth generated by 1.62. Uh, I, I was trying to read the pop-up. Thank you. What is this from? Is growth from 6.8 incorporated pop... So it's based on your overall population, and we're sending 0.1 per million people. It's a split between all of our colonies. Interesting. So this is a multiplicative based off your millions of people. So that is, doo -doo -doo -doo. where is, there, I'm here, laws, or actually institution, it is multi multiplicative of this guy, whatever the modifier here is, for colonial glove, which, I don't know why it says plus, because this is a multiplication that they do, that's something that they should just inherently say it's a multiplicative thing, and that's it, I don't know. Hey, more people! I actually know where this one relatively is. There we go. No more child labor. Perfect. We finally got that. I need more bureaucrats in my life. Um, can we get... At the bottom. Uh, like, why are bureaucrats not here when they're... I, un I understand it's technically an urban building, but like... It's not a. It's not like manufacturing. It's people just sitting at a desk. What do you want here? You want a defensive pack down the No, I'm thinking about killing you. <laughs> Am I blind? Where? Oh, I already have one. I was like, where? Where is my buildings that I desire? Uh, we'll get another two. Do I want this? I mean, sure, might as well. I think we can get the Dutch inside our own colonial uh, league, or even inside our customs union. I'd be happy with that. Yeah, give us a trade agreement. I'm down. I don't see an issue with that. I mean, you can join. The Dutch are attitude towards us is protective. Excuse me? You're not productive of us. I don't even know what rank you are. Hold up. Get, wait. Oh, it's like gallery's free. No, it's just the Netherlands. You declined. My dude. Why are you protective? Needs of their protection. How are we? Your army is weaker than mine. How are you trying to protect me? Your GDP is smaller than mine. What the crap? There's no way we're protective. <laughs> I may be protective of you. Not the other way around. Also, our education is above 50%, so that's always nice. Oh, you just rivaled France? Are you trying to die over there in the Netherlands? Dutch attitude towards us. Yeah, there you go. Get, give me the trade agreement and we'll be happy. Ask to become protectorate. What are you smoking, Netherlands? <laughs> Class above nation. Uh, I mean, this is... No, I don't care about what France's opinion of us. I don't care what they think. And go suck it. Uh, oh, we lost our general. He died. Give me a new one. Why is the La Plata different? Uh, go for Woodland. That's fine. Apparently you need to be promoted as well. Get promoted. Cost me some bureaucrats. Where oh. No, I have no idea. Ar Argentina, are you expanding or something? Let's see. Is there anything we want to do here? Are we, are we playing with any fire here? Conquer some states? I don't really feel like taking that from... Oh, we can go expand over here. 
Is there any reason to? I mean, I go fight Portugal. Who's Portugal friends with? Okay. They don't have a big enough army, to be honest. They have an alliance with Spain. Hmm. Docker there, right? <laughs> Not really surprised. Oh. What do we got? Anything special going on? I think I might end stream a little bit early today, probably at 9 tonight, just because I want to... Uh, I'm going to go look at the, uh, the bulls and stuff like that, I think. Unproductive trade or engines. That's fine. We, I think we produce our own now. Uh, so furniture and clothes are something we're going to need a lot of. Pump jacks. I only have oil, so that's the thing. Fruit fertilizer, I'm down for that. Although I, I still don't have any sulfur. Or not sulfur. Sulfur? Ammonia? I, I don't actually remember what it is. I don't have it, uh, so it doesn't make a difference to me. <laughs> <laughs> sulfur, ammonia. I... Yeah, give me more gold. I'm fine with that. Uh, we already produced plenty. I don't see any issues with it. What do you got here? Unproductive trade routes. Sure. Here are the engines then. We'll produce them ourselves. Uh, which I'm assuming we are doing at this moment. Oh yeah, we're making our own motors. Good. We're making 104. Is that enough? Probably not. Probably need one or more of these things. Let's be realistic. Except, we, oh wow, we got lots of buildings we need to do. Textile moods, field industries, coal, glasswork, railway, arms industry. Uh, we still don't have any furniture. Like, our people have these, like, really nice homes, but they don't have any furniture to put in it because we don't have enough. Uh, I would like to go ahead and get these up a little bit faster. Reducing that mortality rate is going to be nice. Uh, our law enforcement's getting pipped up as well. I don't remember clicking that, but I'm good with that. Uh, how do we got for laws? Politics, anything we want here? I don't think so. Anything that we want here? I mean, we're legitimacy is 100%. I think we're happy. We're sitting nice and happy. No, I don't want to reform the government. I want to go see laws. Uh, I wish you could filter here by, like, most supported law. Make all your people happy out of curiosity. Uh... Ooh, nothing really seems that popular. Peasant levies is garbage. Uh, I'm not going to go do a Stalin brigade. That sounds awful. Sounds like a good way to lose all your people. Uh, nothing is like everyone supports this. Like this national militia looks like a thing. Uh, but I'd rather have a national army or a professional army. That sounds way better. Um... Intervention. Ah, oh, this one could be. And subsidize all buildings. I'm tempted for that. What do we currently have? 25% uh, aristocrats investment pool contribution. I don't think that makes a difference. Elect government run for rail railroads. What do we get here, though? This allows the serfdom law and labor rights. Well, I don't have that anyways. Um, unlock government run for railways. So they do the same thing. Subsidize all buildings. I like that. Um, and it means I would get 5% funding. So we lose 20% on the aristocrats, but we get 25% capitalists, which are way better. Uh, I think. Yeah, this is way better for us. Let's go do that. Uh, I don't care about these people being pissed off. Uh, that's a much better economic policy because uh, we have nine or we have Oh, really, it's only 2k in the investment? I thought this was going to be more. <laughs> well, yeah, we had 57k and we burnt it all. Perfect. We're all that way. Well, that won't be an issue. But I think this will be help super helpful. Alrighty. Law enforcement investment increase. Great. I like having the additional bureaucrats already here. Uh, so that should help. Brazilian market price reports. What's changed? Paper went down. Furniture went down a little bit. Okay. Mortality rates going down. I mean, we should see our population start to spike here, I would hope. Population's almost at 7.5. It's over 7.5 million already. It's going up 1%. That's pretty good. We're 20th in the world, actually. Nice. Uh, We're still a ways away from being the number one. Actually, I don't know if we'll ever become more populous than Ming, but uh, we'll see. 1% growth isn't bad. I wish you could see your mortality here. Uh, we have 5 million children. 
They have less than a million unemployed. That's actually quite a few unemployed. That's more than I thought. We have 700,000 peasants. Unincorporated population. Only 2.79? 2. I thought Paraguay had like 700,000 people. They do. They have the unholy, no, unholiest of numbers. Um, but yeah, they're progressing. They got two months. Amazon, are you done yet? No, you're you're actually almost done. Eight, eight, mil, eight months. You're impoverished. That kind of sucks. But uh, you have a single a single logging camp, and that's all you have. Fair enough. Uh, I have not given you enough of anything. Granted, you don't have enough population for me to do anything. But hey. Still going fine. Do I want more construction? Because we are making a positive. Race center is good. Let's go over to the marketplace. Or uh, buildings. I think we can go ahead and provide more services for our people. What are we really missing here? Missing services at all? No, we're missing opium. I can't produce that. Aren't services supposed to be listed here? Oh, right here. Yeah, we're missing 260. Minus 350. Buildings. Uh, glass, we're going to ignore that for now. Automation here? We want this? Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, where is urban centers? Electric. No, we don't have any electricity. Arcus Wait, Arcus Squares, what is that? No, that's definitely not a thing. But you can go ahead and have public transport, I would say. Lose all those laborers. And go ahead and do something else. Unproductive trade routes. Get rid of that. That's fine. I have plenty of wood. Uh, that we're going to go send to Prussia. I was going to say Prussia, but then they went away. We can send... Why is there no convoys for Haiti? We don't border Haiti. Never mind, we do border Haiti. What the hell happened to Colombia? <laughs> Haiti, what are you doing? Hold up. What do we want to do here? Uh, we're not involved. I can't do... Oh, I don't want to declare... Who's this? Columbia? Is that... Wait. Haiti? Oh, no. I want to join this side. Hold up. I want to go to the right. I want to, like... For you, Adam. <laughs> Columbia. I want, I want Haiti. It's... I'm down. Here, let me join. I, I'm down. Mexico, yeah, us in Mexico come beat up Colombia for why not? Wait, why do we have a revolution brewing? Why? Don't be silly. Support medium radicalism very high. Eh, I don't want to deal with that. This is the only law I actually liked. Hopefully we can actually pass this law first. May, April, May, yeah, we'll actually be able to pass this first. If, if it doesn't pass, then we'll, we'll maybe do something. Now our time to go attack Columbia, actually. It's cordial. Oh, no, no, no. Hold up, Columbia. You are... I can technically... No, we're, we're done. Columbia, you're done. We're going to go kill you. That's what we're going to do. Can I insult? I like to insult them. I need my opinion to go down faster. Did we pass this yet? No. Oh, this is going to actually tick up very slowly. Why are you, uh... Why is it only plus 8? You're going to take my entire navy. But you're going to take... You don't take enough people. I didn't join either side, so... There you go. More people for us. The hope is this passes, and I can completely just, like... I can toggle this real quick. Um, without any... Wait, what? Oh, you forced him to ban slavery. That's nice. That's cute. Oh, market access. We're going to ignore that. Expensive goods. And it did pass. So, what you go ahead and do, you can kind of get around this, is you go and say, hey, we're going to enact this. It gets rid of the revolution, and you can keep toggling it until they're not no longer pissy. You can kind of cheese the system a little bit. So it's going to start ticking down as this blue bar gets closer. You just have to cancel it and restart it. And it uh, is a good way to cheese the system. High tensions. High tension between Brazil and... Why? What, what have I done? I'm just sitting here colonizing. Don't mind me. I mean, yes, I'm going to take this from you, and I don't care. I'm, uh, I'm technically not a, uh, I'm a descendant of a European, but I'm not a European power. We have another migration. Perfect. Population 7.75 million. Great. Where did our bureaucratic shortfall come from? 
Trade routes, social, wait, social security. Oh, yeah, that's this. This ticked up. That ticked up. I mean, yeah, all that's going to start ticking up. Yeah, we need more bureaucrats. Do we finish the uh, this thing? No, you're three months shy. You're 18 months. All right, so we just need a couple more bureaucrats again. Build building. I don't have no population there. What are you missing? Paper? Oh, we're missing paper. I need more paper, guys. Paper is something that we desperately need. I can export steel. Yes, yeah, so I'll give that to the Prussians. Import. Wait, uh, it is sulfur. I need paper. Paper, please. Yes, give me that. The, uh, the Austrians come save my butt because I don't produce enough paper whatsoever. Uh, can I... Like, we should be able to just go use our lumber and be like, use lumber and give me paper. Yeah, see, see the revolution's already going down. It should be going down, right? Yeah, minus one per week. It ticks down very slowly. I uh, don't care about high tensions and go uh, eat it uh, for all I care. Buildings. Urban centers are fine. You should be able to... Yeah, you're already using coal. Fine. Where's my paper bills? I mean, sulfur still is so expensive. Uh, do I pay the extra 7k? Yeah, pay it. I need that paper. It cost us sulfur, and that's fine. I don't care about sulfur. That's whatever. Or migrations. Very good. Uh, I mean, that was like 100,000 people we just got there. Fantastic. What do you want? Insurrection. No, I don't want that. I don't want to piss off you guys off that much. Yeah, let's go and reduce that. That's fine. Not a problem. Columbia. Can I declare war on you yet? Make Dominion. Uh, Uruguay can go get devoured. We have to fight Argentina. Do I care about Argentina? I didn't even know that Argentina... I thought Argentina was underneath us. They are. They're my Dominion. Why are you... Why? You're loyal. Don't do this to me. Hunter State. Brazil has a claim on the Amazons. Yes, I do. But I should still be able to declare war. Uh, make Dominion. Go for this. I'd rather just conquer it for myself, probably. How many people are there? I mean, some people are a little radical right now. It's okay. I mean, it's 300 million people. It's good for agriculture as well. I'm gonna push that real quick. Hopefully they stand down. I, I don't actually see a reason why I would have to fight. Go there. There you go. Argentina's a vassal, so I don't even know why I'd have to fight them. Um, and this just got split into two fronts, which means new general. Military. Group general. Brazil HQ, will an expert. No, give me supply rationing. That seems fine. On that front. No, originally uh, they were two separate. Uh, you guys are going to go there. That's fine. We're already dealing with that. They're below, oh, getting, ticking down below 50%. Anything that we need in the journal? Gimme see. Interest groups in Brazil, 6 out of 8. Steam engine. Not quite there. Yeah. Uh, we just need to upgrade our engines. Uh, plus one, actually. That's not too bad. Food industry is built up. Wow, that's uh, already profitable. What are you missing? Glass. Yeah, that's a thing. We don't produce that yet. I thought the game crashed again. I was going to laugh. Buildings. I need another... Oh, I'm already building it. Good. 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 Steel mill is not producing anything, though, and I'm concerned. I will upgrade that real quick. Uh, that's a no. My current governor is winning by seven points. I mean, it's... You're, you're, in, you're in Connecticut, right? I, I don't think that's really surprising. All right, it's time for us to cancel this and restart it. 
just to continue getting rid of the revolution because I don't actually want it, uh, but it's a thing that I have to have. Seriously, why you went to the wrong front? Go to that one. There you go. Don't care. Bureaucratic. Why are we having a bureaucratic shortfall? Be producing an abundance of paper. That porch. Give me more cargo. Yes, we can afford those now. Gold mines. Yep. Give me that. That's an extra K. Uh, that's expensive. That's a no on the lead mines. You're fine. You're already at tier three. Automated. Uh, dynamite is too expensive for us. Uh, nope, we don't have electricity yet. We have not done that. Vineyards, I don't... That doesn't make a difference. I'd rather have the grain for our people. Um, it's going to get too expensive pretty quick. You guys are split. Um, yeah, I mean, we could toggle that. I don't think that's really that big of a deal. Steam donkeys for coal and engines. We don't produce enough of those yet. Uh, we're going to work on that. Why do you want this law? I don't want this law. We're purely doing that to prevent the revolution from spawning. Did Columbia, Columbia really join this war? But you are a butt. Go there. Um, and you guys are going to go kill Paraguay real quick. I think we don't have enough troops for this, so we're going to actually raise the conscripts. Activate the conscripts. I think 34 conscripts is going to be enough. Let's go ahead and grab another general here. You... Or you're a mountain expert. I don't think that makes that big of a difference. Uh, you're going to mobilize. You're going to go and be on this front. And be happy about it. Like, I don't know why we're fighting Argentina when they're already part of our dominion. You shouldn't be allowed to fight your overlord. Uh, we're also going there. Um, yeah, we'll just have to wait for our conscripts. An effective agriculture. Sure. Arms. Like... We shouldn't even be fighting here. Argentina should be, is loyal to us. But Uruguay should fall very quickly. And the fact... Like, why is... Like, our 18,000 troops are not there yet. And so Venezuela or Colombia just gets to walk into our land. Which is kind of annoying. 7v2. Uh, that should fall pretty quick. Because once Uruguay falls, the war is already over. You, my friend. Well, the coast of Brazil. Sure. I mean, we have a pos a huge surplus right now. I don't know what happened. But uh, we're going to walk over here and we're going to just reduce our taxes a little bit. No, just, just one. Just one's fine. Apparently our taxes just got really good. Even though we have completely ineffective uh, bureaucrats right now. Which is concerning. Urban, where are our bureaucrats at? Seem fine. What is eating all of our uh, stuff? Colonial fairs, health. Si oh, just each of those tiers is just actually causing a huge, uh, huge deficit. How are conscripts doing? Because they have not hit the front yet. Oh, apparently they're not. Okay, they're just being mobilized still. I see. Regulars and zero. You bug. No. Okay. You just, that is very confusing. Ugh. Yeah, we're just going for this logic to uh, prevent the revolution. Because we're just going to keep toggling and canceling it. Because they can't rebel if they're, you're appeasing them. So. No. I'd rather have that investment already there. So we are losing this. Actually, we're going to be able to defend that. How did we invade? Like, our army quality is, is significantly worse? Oh no, our army is way better than theirs. Holy crap. Three of our division is equal to one of theirs. Okay. Uh, that's good. Paraguay is... Or Uruguay is gone after this battle, and they should pretty much just collapse. Like, why is this a separate front? Like, this front is being collapsed by this one, which makes no sense. There goes Uruguay. It's gone. You maybe want to capitulate? 
Look at that. Minus f almost 400, really. Size of Uruguay gold reserves. Uruguay, you don't have an army. That's all I'm saying. Economy's fine. Colombia's going to fall. Like, their army sucks, and we're going to go kill them afterwards. Unproductive trade routes. Uh, I would like that paper. No, I didn't want that. <laughs> uh -huh. No, I didn't want that. Give me back my law. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Uh, this will actually cause a revolution to tick up, though, ironically. Uh, so we actually have to... We can't do this anymore. No! You guys are appeased because I accidentally uh, looked away for too long. What is this? Excuse me. You don't get to walk into my land. That's not how this works. And we merge the two fronts. Okay. I would have preferred not to have merged them. But Colombia will fall very quickly. I hope. Where are our conscripts, by the way? I have no idea where my conscripts are. They are uh, nowhere to be found. Already conscripted. They haven't made it to the front. Amazonian migration. Well, that's exciting. Amazon's, uh, they haven't had a proper uh, migration yet. Uh, they got like 20,000 people. That was not that much. There you go. You're awake officially. There we go. Great. The war's already over. And now Argentina is part of us now. Uh, it looks like Haiti lost their war against Colombia as well. Unfortunate. But we're, we're sitting here. Sitting here happy. You're wary of us. That's fine. I mean, we did kick you out. Do you want to do something? Maybe like join our... Uh... I'm not going to add more of those. I don't want to join. United States is a no. Ecuador will join. Yeah, sure. Come on in. Join. Add, add your stuff to our market. Ecuador. Yeah, you can just give us trade as well. Beat now. Okay. 12 and a half K. Diplomatic packs. Is that just for my Dominion? It is. Argentina is paying us 5,000 pounds. That's pretty good. No. Do that. Trade agreement declined. X. We have no trade between our markets. It literally just said you would accept. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> oh, nice. Alrighty, so you're wary, that's fine. It's nice to see that we're actually expanding, new parties formed. I mean, we basically had one party and we were all happy with it, I thought. I thought we were all happy, apparently not. Uh, we need more bureaucrats. Give me those three, which hopefully will be enough. Uh, I don't... This is going up. I would like our standard of living. It's We're almost to the middling point, because that's 15, so we're almost there. We're number 53 in the world out of our 14th ranking. GDP is number 10 in the world. That's pretty good. Uh, I definitely won't complain about that. And our radicals are declining as well, which is very nice. Election, we don't care about that. Loyalists are also on the mend. All of that is good stuff. I definitely appreciate that. That's due to us reducing our taxes. Everyone's happier. Don't care about that. Shh. Why are tools expensive? Wait, why do we have low legitimacy in our government? Hold up. What happened? It's 0%? Oh. Ooh. What, what, what's going on here? Get out. That helps. Get out. That helps as well. Trade unionists. I mean, for the most part, I'm happy with you guys. You want it? Helps a little bit. What's the big thing that's killing us here? Like, these are the three big three. Armed forces want it or something? No, armed forces are bad. No, no, no. You guys don't get to come in here then. I'm assuming that there's like, they fight each other right now. Government clout, 52%. I mean, you guys have to stay. Everyone else, I don't like. Can I just be just them? Yeah, we can. That's fine. I mean, we're we're redoing our reforms, so 
I wish it would tell you what their actual clout was, though. Like, here is... Oh, this is actual their clout. Never mind. I mean, you guys probably give us a bonus. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be it. That'll be it. Uh, we gain 42,000 radicals. I don't care. We've declined that enough. That's not an issue. And that went down. Defensive pack with chili. Uh, chili. I will accept that because you're gonna you're gonna join here. You're friendly. Uh, there you go. Give us that customs. There you go. You can join our market. Sure, that's fine. You guys can do that. They're already part of our party, so I don't care. Alrighty, so with Colum or Chile in, we have probably half of South America at that point. We are colonizing over here very slowly. Uh, not really doing much. It's It has peasants, and that's about peasants. That's about it. Um, Yeah, I'd say that's about it. What are we doing on our budget? Assets. Got 31,000k in the state budget. That's fine. I'm going to say that's all the time that I have today because I want to go and pay attention a little bit more to the uh, the election going on right now. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys please like and subscribe. And we'll be back next week. Have a wonderful day.